Hey Internet, I just wanted to post a quick review uh, or comparison between the Hatchbox and Amazon Basics PLA filament. Um, they seem to be priced very similarly. Um, I got my hands on a couple rolls of Hatchbox filament. Um, the first thing, I, first thing I noticed between the two of them is the Hatchbox rolls have this nice clean machine wind to the filament, whereas the uh, Amazon Basics has, uh, well, a little more chaotic wind. Um, the, uh, the Amazon Basics has a nicer spool in that it has this window, so you can see how much uh, filament you have left. Uh, the Hatchbox doesn't have that. Um, not a big deal, but it's nice to, nice to have. Um, but the big difference is in their performance. So this is a, it's called a heat tower. Um, so the idea is you print it at the high heat at the bottom. And hopefully you can see that it says 240. Uh, anyways, you set it to decrease by five degrees every, uh, I think it's 10 millimeters or five millimeters or something. Um, nonetheless, it's to see what the best heat or temperature is to print your filament on your printer. Um, this is the hatch box. It didn't do great, but that's probably uh, due to my inexperience in 3D printing. And this is the uh, Amazon Basics filament. Now, again, this might be on me that it didn't turn out perfect, but these are on the same settings. This, I printed one of these, and I printed one of these. Actually, I printed obviously two of these, and I printed one of these. Uh, all in the same machine with the same settings. And the uh, Amazon Basics one, just goopy as all get out. Um, you know, maybe you can compensate for that, but I'd rather have a filament that requires less compensation. Um, so anyways, they, they seem to be about the same price, often within a buck of each other. To me, it seems well worth even if it is an extra buck or two to get the hatchbox filament. Um, it's just easier to use in that it's wound better and uh, clearly produces better results. Um, to be honest, I think the, uh, the, uh, the color of it is nicer. The, the uh, Amazon Basics tends to be sort of a flat uh, and the uh, Hatchbox is kind of shiny. I don't know, for better or worse. Anyways, hope that's helpful.